Hello everyone. Today we will do a speed test between the Galaxy Note 9 and the Mi 8 Lite. So guys, without talking a lot, now let's jump to the multitasking. Sorry guys for speed test. Phone dollar on both phone. Messages. Chrome on both phone. And let's clear everything in the background. So guys, history, history. So this cleared and let's clear this also all the time clear all the time clear on both phone let's close everything in the background now let's open facebook on both phone i think about a little bit not nine apple.com apple.com on both phone and go Let's see which one will gonna be. Is it gonna be my yes, MI8 Lite? Weather on both phone, MI8 Lite a little bit faster. Play Store on both phone, MI8 Lite a little bit faster. File Manager, MI again with no animation. I think the animation is turned up by the default. So, guys, everything is default on these phones. YouTube faster on the Note 9 calendar faster on the Mimic 3 sorry guys MI8 lights Google on both phone and YouTube about the same clock now let's do them again Instagram I think about the same Facebook Faster on the Note 9 calculator 1 plus 19, 1 plus 19. Now let's see, shared on both phone. Faster, I think about the same. Poop G on both phone, and let's see how they will run the game. I think the Note 9 will gonna be faster because it has got. Snapdragon 845 or Exynos the CPU made by the Samsung equal to the Snapdragon now let's see which one will gonna be faster I hope you guys enjoy the video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video if you like it if not just tell me anything you want in the comment section below and I will try to fix it as soon as possible Let's see, is it gonna be not mine? No. This time faster on the MI8 lights. I am pressing with this phone. Now let's start. I think we should put this on the HDR2. And this is at the maximum also. Both 6 GB of RAM, but this Snapdragon 616 and this 845. Now let's start both the game at the same time let's see let's see welcome to PUBG mobile you all guys can see the smoothness is very good on the Note 9 this phone is really powerful in terms of gaming I'm really impressed with this phone now let's do it about the same on the Mimic MI8 Lite the smoothness is also great this phone is really great but with a little bit of lagging I don't know why but just normal with these phones because the price are about two hundred sixty-five dollar. Now, guys, let's jump to the multitasking again and see how they will perform in terms of opening apps and their multitasking. Messenger on both phone, MX player, music, TikTok on both phone. 
and it will put faster on the my 8 lights gmail on both phone faster on the note 9 subway surfer on both phone let's see Is it gonna be Note 9 or the MI8 Lite? Wow, MI8 Lite. I'm really impressed with this phone. It's really fast phone. Viber, faster on the MI8 Lite. White Studio. Now, let's do color. Video editor, faster on the MI8 Lite. Video show. Again, faster on the MI8 Lite. RAR faster on the note 9 now let's jump to the multitasking play store on both phone no refreshing my files refreshing on the note 9 youtube refreshing on both phone calendar about the same google no refreshing on both phone clock no refreshing whatsoever instagram about the same but i think not now was faster facebook on both phone not nine calculator sure it the same pubg both refresh it the game messenger mx player music TikTok on both phone, both refresh it, Gmail, both refresh it, Subway Surfer, no refreshing on the Note 9, but refreshing on the MI8 Lite, Viber on both phone, about the same, YG Studio, again refreshing on the MI8 Lite, True Color, again refreshing, Video Editor, no refreshing, Video Show, no refreshing on both, RAR, Refreshing on the MI8 Lite. So guys, this was the test between the MI8 Lite and the Galaxy Note 9, the flagship from Samsung. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and tell me anything you don't like in my videos. So I will fix it in the next videos. Thanks for watching. Peace for everyone.